Welcome to your new one-stop experience for development in the 901. Hello and thank you for attending the Develop 901 Citizen Portal How to Apply for a Permit and Pay Fees video training. This training will cover the 15-step process to apply for a permit then pay the fees for your permit. Before proceeding, you must have an account. If you do not have an account, please refer to our training, Excel at Citizens Access, How to Register for an Account. Let's get started. Step 1. Log in to the Citizen Portal using your existing credentials. Step 2. Select the application category. Step 3. Click Create an application to start your request. Step 4. Once you have read and agreed to the terms, please click the checkbox, I have read and accepted the above terms. Then click the Continue Application button to move forward. Step number five. You are now ready to choose the type of application that you need. It is important to select the correct record type in this section. For instance, if you are looking for a residential demolition permit, be sure to select Demolition Permit and not the other choices that are listed for residential. We will demonstrate with a residential mechanical permit. Please select the mechanical residential mechanical permit record type, then click the continue application button. Step 6. Now you will enter the contacts for this project on the contact list section. Click the add new button on the contact list section. The select contact type dialog box will appear. Select the type of contact you will be entering. At minimum you have to enter the applicant as a contact. Select applicant and click the continue button. Complete the information on the contact information screen. Then click the continue button. This will take you back to the contact list section with a message that the contact has been added. Step 7. Next we will enter the License Professional. Click the Add New button in the License Professional section. The License Professional Information dialog will appear. Enter the License Professional information and click the Save and Close button. This will take you back to the License Professional list section with a message that the License Professional has been added.
click the Continue Application button. Step 8. Next, you will enter the street number and street name only. Do not fill out all the fields. Then click the Search button. The address search result list will display. Scroll down and select the correct address from the choices provided. The correct address, parcel, and owner information will get filled in. Click the Select button. Scroll down and click the Continue Application button. Step 9. Next, you will have to fill out the project information, description of work, and project details information. This is the detail information about the project. Enter the required detail information, then click Continue Application when all fields with an asterisk are completed. Step 10. Now you will enter any attachments needed for the permit on the Documents Attached Documents screen. Use this page to upload the documents to support your application. Please pay special attention to the document types required in the description. Click the Add button to bring up the File Upload dialog box. Click the Add button to select and upload the documents. Add all the relevant documents. Click the Continue button. Step 11. Select the attachment type and add a description for each document you attached. Then click the Save button. Your documents will be uploaded. Click the Continue Application button. Step 12. Please review your application to assure its accuracy. Click the Continue Application button. Step 13. If everything is correct and all the necessary documents have been attached, you will be taken to the Pay Fees screen. Here you can check out and pay your fees. Step 14. Review your fees on the Pay Fees screen. To pay your permit fees, click on the Check Out button. Your permit application will be displayed with the total due. Click on the arrow next to your permit to see a breakdown of the pricing. Click on the checkout button to enter your payment information.
you will be forwarded to the official payments website to process your transaction. Enter your payment information, then click the Submit Payment button. Your payment method will be processed. Step 15. Once the payment process has been completed successfully, you will be given your record ID. You can use the record ID to track the status of your application. Please print or write down the record ID so that you can refer back to your application at any given time. This concludes our video training for the Develop 901 Citizen Portal How to Apply for Permit and Pay Fees. Thank you for attending and have a great day.